How you doing guys? It is October 26, 2017. On this little vlog here, I want to talk about a couple of things. Update on my truck. Uh, my truck, a couple of days ago, I lost the brakes on the way in to get an inspection sticker. And uh, I got a call from him today. Um, I guess the master cylinder's got issues also, so he had to order the master cylinder from a company in Ohio. That's the only problem with my truck is um, it's a workhorse truck and you have to get parts to the workhorse dealer. So he's saying you know, Wednesday or something like that. So I told him, I said, well, try to get it next day. Yeah, I know they don't work on the weekends over there, but today's already Thursday, so I might not get my truck back till Wednesday or something. So I'm kind of like in limbo. I can't do much without my truck, and I don't like switching over and working out of a pickup truck unless I have to. It's, it's been pretty warm here, um, you know, pretty much 70 during the day. Uh, really hasn't been getting that cold, so... You know, people that have emergencies, I just tell them, you know, if you can't, you can't wait, you need to call someone else type of thing. So that's what's going on there. I just wanted to do a little update because I might not have videos for a little while because my truck's down. And uh, maybe I'll try to do some some other stuff with me with my channel. I'm always breaking it up and trying to do different type of videos and uh, bringing you different stuff and uh, trying to do different angles on things. Just try, try to, you know... Uh, bring something every day. I'll try to do do my best. Uh, as far as the ducks go, I've been selling. I sold quite a few ducks today. Some ladies been calling me about them, and I sold them for a good price. Um, I think I got like uh, five pairs left, just pairs, uh, male and females. I'm gonna try to sell them off like that. I am definitely getting downsizing on the ducks. I have sold quite a few of the chickens. I'm downsizing on the chickens. I want to get down to a, a much smaller flock, maybe and maybe two coops. Uh, two or three coops this this winter instead of having all these I got chickens just too many of them And you guys told you that in a, a couple of videos ago. I'm gonna be downsizing. And that's what I'm doing I'm in the process. I am I am working on that and uh, getting it down to a reasonable amount Yeah, another thing I got going on um, One of my ex-brother-in-laws uh, He is a janitor at one of these schools and um, you know he goes in there later in the day and cleans up the school and stuff and he, he had a bunch of chickens, and he came over and see my chicken operation, and uh, he, he's trying to fix his coop up, to you know, because he wants to get some more chickens, and he wants to make it more secure, because I guess he had a couple of weasels in there and killed all his chickens. But anyway, he's um, he's in the process of building his chicken coop, strengthening it, and making it better like mine is, and he wants to get some chickens. So he said, hey, listen, if you want any uh, food, you know, I get a lot from, from the... Uh, from the from the cafeteria, I mean, there's a bunch of stuff I throw out every day. I says, well, bring it by here. These chickens will eat it, you know, as long as it's something decent. Uh, these chickens will eat anything. So he drops me off pretty much like three, four uh, days a week, a whole whole uh, garbage bag. I mean, it, the thing is not full, but there's a lot in the bottom of this garbage bag, enough to feed all my chickens like nothing. Uh, pizzas and, uh, you know macaroni and sandwiches and all kinds of stuff and i just i just hoof it grind it up if it's if it's uh you know sandwiches and stuff i'll throw it through the processor any kind of like pizza and stuff like that um you know throw it right out there in their runs and in, in, in their food containers and these guys chow right down like nothing it's like unbelievable salad stuff and lettuce and all kinds of stuff cookies and you'd be surprised what, what's in there bread and these I throw all that stuff in the run. I go back there, saving me on the feed. You know, I don't have to give these guys as much food. I give them that stuff, and they chow right down. And as long as they have enough protein, they're all right. You know, and I have I give them extra protein every day anyway. So, as long as they get in their sixteen percent protein, they'll they'll lay eggs. And uh, yeah, so that's another 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 angle I got going on with, with the food. And you know, it's pretty cool. I am downsizing. When I get to the point where I'm when I get less chickens, I won't be able to do all this stuff. Uh, that I'm doing for them. I'll be, I'll be bringing in too much food to feed what I have left. But I'm definitely still downsizing. But just figured you guys get a kick out of that. Uh, you know, there's a lot of free food out there. If you get the right angles. And, you got, you know, actually the guy drops it right off at my house. You know, I give him eggs. I give all the girls at the at the school. I give them a bunch of eggs every week. And they're, they're, they're you know, happy. They, do, they don't care. They're going to throw the stuff out anyway. So, the sandwich is a couple of days old. You know, they're going to throw it out. I'll give that to the chickens. I mean, they'll chomp that right down like nothing. Just figured you guys get a kick out of that. I want, just a question for you guys. Do you like these type of vlogs? Uh, you know, I know a lot of guys that follow me. They seem to enjoy them. So I just wanted to know if, if this is uh, something that you guys don't mind once in a while. You know, I'm not going to do it every day. I, I kind of break things up. When I go work on videos, I post that. And sometimes I do vlogs, coffee chats, or whatever. I might even try a couple other things. 
But just a quick little update on that. Just wanted to let you guys know. So if I don't post any videos for a couple of days, that you know, don't worry about me. I'm fine. It's just that, yeah, I got no vehicle. And uh, just doing stuff around the house here. Like I did a bunch of, uh, caught up on a bunch of um, office work that I needed to do and uh, stuff like that. But yeah, that's it. Let me see if I can get the baby dog. Oh. Here she is, the baby dog. You're the big star of the show, man. You a looker? Oh, yeah, you a looker. I know a lot of guys like the little baby dog, but she's doing good. She's sleeping under, underneath the um, office desk here. You're getting to be a little stinker. You need a bath. Oh, yeah, you do. You're a little stinker. You need a bath. Huh? That's it. The star of the show right there, the baby dog. She's my friend. She's my friend. You my friend? Oh, yeah, you my. You are my friend. All right, guys. Just a quick little update on what's going on with the truck and... Hey, at least I didn't crash it, and I was in, you know, close to the place, and when I lost my br brakes, I was kind of like on flat ground. There's a lot of areas around here that's really steep, man. If I was going down these steep areas and hit them brakes and lost my brakes, that truck's got 14,007 tons. I mean, the thing's loaded. Uh, you know, I could have really, really hurt somebody or myself, so I consider myself lucky. And, uh, you know, if the master cylinder's bad, it's got to be replaced. That's all. All right, guys. Uh, more videos to come.